you can connect devices running the following operating systems to the workspace. Windows, Mac OS, Android and iOS. To connect devices to the workspace, send invitations to the users. All they need to do is follow the link in the invitation, download the installer and run it. Users don't need to make any decisions. A user must have administrator permissions to be able to install the components. The link in the invitation is universal and helps install a security application on any device, computer, smartphone or tablet. Kaspersky Endpoint Security Cloud automatically recognizes the operating system version and redirects the device to the respective installation package. The downloaded distribution contains Kaspersky Endpoint Security and KSC Network Agent. The installation wizard does not prompt the user for anything, but requires administrative permissions. You can't choose a language pack for Mac OS. Kaspersky Endpoint Security for Mac includes several localizations and selects the language automatically according to the operating system settings. If Kaspersky Endpoint Security for Mac is not activated during the installation, it will receive a license as soon as it connects to the cloud server. You can install Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile and connect a device to the workspace if it is running Android 4.2 or later. If you cannot open the invitation on a phone for some reason, open it on your computer, scroll down and scan the QR code with the device that needs to be connected. The QR code contains the same link as the invitation. The link first leads to a web server in Kaspersky Endpoint Security Cloud that identifies the device's operating system. Kaspersky Endpoint Security Cloud redirects Android devices to the Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile page in Google Play, from where you can install the application. Complete the setup wizard of Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile. Accept the user agreement and grant the following rights to the application. File access permissions are required to scan files for malicious components. Administrator permissions are required to lock or wipe the device remotely if it is lost or stolen. Location permissions are required to determine the device's location if it is lost or stolen. Camera access permissions are necessary to take pictures of a person who uses a stolen or lost phone. Accessibility service permissions enable the app to scan websites before they are opened. The installation has completed. If you are using a Samsung device, you will also need to accept an agreement for integration with Samsung Knox. After the installation completes, Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile will report issues because there is no license on the device. Kaspersky Endpoint Security will receive it from the server in a few minutes, after which it will update the signature databases and scan the device. Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile synchronizes with the workspace once every six hours by default. Additionally, Kaspersky Endpoint Security for mobile receives messages from the workspace via Firebase Cloud Messaging, FCM a push notification system by Google. Thanks to FCM, the device can receive updated settings and commands within seconds instead of waiting for the next scheduled synchronization. Installation on a Windows computer differs only in appearance. As is the case for other devices, download the installation package, run it and wait for the installation to finish. By default, computers are not assigned to users and the default security profile is applied to them. If you plan to use custom security profiles, Assign owners to those devices and select the necessary profiles for them.